You're watching Fishing Saskatchewan, brought to you in part by The Fishing Home. Get hooked at The Fishing Home. North Sask Farm Equipment, Highway 16 North Battleford. Come see us for all your recreational and agricultural needs. And Alumacraft, built by fishermen for fishermen. So on this trip at Lac La Ronge, we've been running various lures behind the downriggers. Uh, that three dot canoe there has been one of the faves, probably the most productive spoon. Yeah, this one is a, it's a canoe spoon made by Lucky Strike. Uh, and this is definitely the, uh, uh, the lure that we're catching the majority of the trout on this weekend. Yeah, we, I mean, we've been trying stuff like uh, Len Thompson's half waves, different shapes, different colors. Uh, white with the three dots, even the one dot, doesn't produce as much as the three dot this trip. That's subtle these days. Eh? Yeah, it's uh, it's interesting, and, and I mean that's why we're trying different stuff on on uh, both the regular just to isolate the pattern and, and stick with what we want, uh, what's what's doing the best. Oh, there we go. Come on. Yeah, I will. Daddy. Uh, yeah. That's. Hard to tell with these fish how big they really are. Doesn't feel like it's got a huge amount of weight, but then again, it's not close to the boat yet. There it is. Nice white on that one, eh? That's a pretty fish. Yep. Pliers? Right here. Good hook set, right by the lip. Initially felt a lot better than what we had. Started taking drag right off the bat, so we're moving it this way now though. You can see it still feels pretty good. Very yeah, good. about the same size we've been getting. A little darker coloring. Yeah. Not quite a silver some of them. Nope, but and if this is the average fish you're pulling in. Guy could do that all day. Straight down. Awesome. Oh, there we go. Hook him up, Steve. There you go. Now we got a double. Oh. How close are you there, Steve? Uh, I'm not very close. There you go. I'll take the net from you, Mike, if you want to release that. I'll help Steve out. Terry, you can... That is a female. Oh, oh that's interaction. Point her towards me. Beautiful. Nice work, Steve. Good job, Smitty. Yeah. Oh, Good job. Good job. Good job. Oh. That's a female, too. 15. Yep. Well, we're getting close. 30. Four and a half to take the lead. That's fair. Yep. Three, four and a half again? Yep. <clears throat> Another good fish here. It's gotta be 15. Oh, it's gotta be. Wow, it's 12 at least. Oh, 15, 15, 15. Well, I think. Awesome. Today we've been using uh, downriggers to catch lake trout. And I'm just going to give you a quick demo on uh, how to use uh, the Scotty electric downrigger. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to let, let your lure out about 40, 50 feet behind your uh, cannonball. Then what you're going to want to do is you got to grab the tip of your line, reach down, Pull in your cannonball, which will be dragging just behind, and then you're going to have your clip. So this is where you clip in your uh, your line, which is also the release. So when the fish hits, it'll pull out of that, and you won't be uh, dragging any additional weight. So the next thing we do, we use a little lever on the side. This drops your cannonball down. And you just, uh, open your bale, let the line go out, 
there we go we're at about the depth we want to be at right now so then you just uh, get a little bit of slack get your rod in and crank it down now uh, you can see there's a pretty good bow there when the fish hits your line straightens up then you're good to go set the hook A little head shake. Oh, there she is. There she goes. Nice play. Perfect size for the smoker. Seven pounds. Yeah. And others have to be under. Right. Such a strong fish. How quickly they revive. You really don't have to. You're doing an excellent job getting them in and out. Yeah. That makes a big difference. Yeah, the amount of time you can keep them out of the water is. Uh, yeah, you can probably see the log way, 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 way. Well, how are you turning with you? No, no, that's beautiful. We you see them, it's gotta be 20 feet down and you can still see them taking off. The lake trout fishing is probably by far the best in the 32 years we've ever had. Walleye, every, every fish has been in a cycle. I've seen many cycles up and down. Walleye are in the top. Uh, the size wise is better. Northern Pike is coming back uh, very strongly in the last few years. Ten years ago, Northern Pike were way down. But the lake cycles up and down and I would say we're in a very good cycle right now for the three species. One of our better ones. I thought it was still attached to the downer here. It's not coming anywhere right now. You feeling up, dude? Uh, big. This is probably the longest fight we've had. Really? Definitely on the yeah. downriggers for sure. Smitty, we're close. Dude, yep, I'm here. And over here, take him. Yeah. Step a little left. Watch your feet. Belly on it. Female for sure. We're getting lots of these. Thanks for watching Fishing Saskatchewan. Until next time, we'll see you on the water. Fishing Saskatchewan has been brought to you by The Fishing Hole. North Sask Farm Equipment and Alumacraft.